Hey guys, so I have a haul video for you today. This one's a little bit smaller than my usual hauls, but I wanted to do this before um, my next haul, which I'm assuming anyway will be my Vegas haul, because I'm going to uh, Vegas Tuesday morning. Today is Sunday, so, but this video is not going to go up probably, I don't, I don't, I don't know. Anyway, um, that's that, okay. Um, if my hair changes form throughout the video, it's because it's wet right now and I'm sure it'll start to dry um, as I keep talking, so just that's what's happening there. Alright, so I have a ShopLately.com order. I'm sure if, if you've seen any of my hauls, you've seen something from ShopLately before. If you haven't seen the site, uh, I don't know what you've been doing. They sell jewelry, clothing, purses, watches, where's my lighting going? Okay, well then. As I was saying, Shop Lately is a website that has just a, pretty much everything you could possibly want. They have flash sales, um, and I frequent the site a lot, as you guys have probably already seen. Alright, so if you don't know how it works, there are a bunch of different sellers, and you can order different things from various sellers, but you have to pay shipping for each seller unless you join their, like, program, I can't remember what it's called, I'll put the name right here because I really, I'm, I'm blanking right now, but I paid for it, it's $9 a year, and shipping is generally $3, um, like, an order, like, a, from each seller, so it makes sense to just do the $9 a year. Oh, Shop Lately Insider program, is that what it's called? I, I think, okay. The first seller I bought from is called A&O, it's like A plus O style, I believe. I should just, like, look at this. Yes, yeah, so this is Ave and O Styles. So I got two items from them. I have ordered from them before, and I really enjoy. I think I got two rings from them, and I like both of them a lot. Um, look, this time I got earrings and a necklace. I'm switching it up a bit. So I got this necklace. It's an antique, kind of brassy gold, and it has a, a round pendant with some like faux turquoise in the middle. So it came like this, and. It looks like that. So I really have been looking for some kind of basic long necklaces. I feel like some of the ones in stores right now, like if you go to the mall, are very cheap looking and just fake. And I know they're all like fake stones and stuff, but they just look really, really fake. So um, there's that one. And I like the, the place where it lays on me as well. So there's that one. I believe this was $10. Alright, so these earrings, if you guys watched my, uh, I think it, it was that haul video where I was wearing the romper and my hair was like crazy, um, that haul video, I think that was the one where I got my first Druzy piece, and uh, I got these earrings, and oh my god, these are probably the most beautiful earrings ever, I'm freaking obsessed with them. So from that Druzy ring that I got in that haul, I knew from then on that I really liked Druzy and I wanted to get more stuff like that. And so I got these earrings. They've been in my favorites on Shop Lately for a while. I just never ordered them. Oh, they're so pretty. These are really cool because depending on how the light hits them, they can be like a really warm, goldeny, greeny, turquoise color or they can be like a royal blue too. It's like the oddest thing. I don't know, but these are so pretty. Plus, they're post back, which I I can't really do just the fish hook earrings anymore because they pull too much. But post back ones, um, uh, these are just I can't. Oh my god, they're so pretty. Clearly, they're more summery, but whatever. I'm gonna wear them in the fall because just look, they're just uh, I can't. Mm, I, uh, mm, it's so pretty. So I'm sure you guys will see those in several other videos at some point in time. Those I believe were fourteen dollars. Okay, and lastly, uh, before I get any questions about this necklace, because I'm sure I would if I didn't mention it, this is also from Shop Lately, this is from my last order, but this is from Daisy Gem, which I've also ordered from that merchant before as well. I This was also sitting in my favorites for a while, I just never ordered it, but can you, like, come on, this is... This is a badass necklace, like, I don't know how else to describe it. My brother, when he saw me wearing it, he was like, I think he described it as a combination between goth and, I think he said Hannibal Lecter, is that, he used, was it Hannibal Lecter? Or, I can't remember, it was some, like, fantastical killer. I was just like, do you, what, what? But anyway, it's actually not as heavy as it looks. I mean, it's not a dainty piece by any means, but it's not, it's not super heavy. It doesn't hurt my neck or anything like that. I love this, though. Like, I just got it, I think, two days ago, and I, I've already worn it twice, so. <laughs> There, 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 what? Stop. I love it. Okay, that's it. 
Alright, next I have some stuff from Forever 21. I picked up three things, one of which I've already worn and the other two I have not yet. Uh, we'll pull these out of the bag. So I will start off with the shirt that I've already worn because it's my favorite and I'm obsessed with it and I kind of want to wear it like every day because it's just, it's me. So it's this crop top. If you follow me on Instagram, you've already seen it probably, but it says, um, okay, like literally, if I was a t-shirt, it would be this one, <laughs> like, this is me. I was wearing it at home when I was, like, home with my parents, and my mom was like, that's a Katie shirt. Like, <laughs> there's no way around it. Like, this is literally, I've said literally way too many times this video, I apologize already, but, uh, this, like, this is my response to nearly everything. Like, whenever things happen, I'm just like, mm, okay, <laughs> Seriously, I can't just, ah! It's a size medium, uh, and I believe it was like twelve eighty or one of those weird prices. It was fairly reasonable, and I mean, I just, I couldn't not buy it, so there's that. Okay. Next thing is a basic stripe tank. Uh, I am super into stripes. I always have been. I remember, I think it was my freshman year of college, and I was shopping with my roommate, and she was, I was picking out things, and I think like three of them were striped, and she's like, you know, you always look at stripes, so like, you always pick out stripes. So I was like, I honestly didn't notice it until she pointed out, and I was like, oh, <laughs> this is a problem. But, so I've, I feel like I've expanded my horizons since then, but I've always just had a very uh, strong love for stripes. Why am I still talking about this? I don't know. It's just a basic uh, blue and I guess gray stripe tank, and it has super low armholes. You guys know how much I love that. <laughs> um, and it was really inexpensive. This was only $9.90, and it was the last one, and it's a medium, so there's that. Super basic. Lastly, I actually picked up these shorts today. I had to go to the mall, uh, hit up Sephora for my mom's birthday. Um, but I got these shorts. You guys know how I feel about printed <laughs> shorts. I love them, and they're just, I just, I love them. So, these are a size small, they're 1580. I didn't even try them on, so, um, when I try them on for you guys in the thing, that's probably the first time that I'll have them on my body. This kind of style and print in particular is a really good transitional piece into fall because you can wear these with like some sheer tights or some knee high socks or both. Um, and some boots and style them up for fall and winter that way, so I just thought that was nice. I also stopped by Cotton On last week and they were having some sale on a bunch of their stuff. And I don't really know why this was on sale because it's definitely like a fall winter piece. I'm not complaining though. Um, I got this striped <laughs> sweater. I love this. I love this so much. Like when I put it on in the dressing room I was like, this is coming home with me. And it's, it's, I mean, it's super plain, but it's just something that I would wear, like, all the time. So, it's kind of like an oatmeal-y color with blue stripes, so. There is that. And I just, it's so comfy, and I'm excited. No, again? Alright, lastly, I did go to CVS and picked up some stuff. I had some uh, extra bucks to use up, so I figured I would just get some random things. And I got two of the original baby lips that I had never tried before because they were on sale for, I think, two for five, and they're normally like four bucks or something. Uh, so I picked up Cherry something, Cherry Me, and Grapevine. My mom loves this grape one. I mean, loves it. My mom is like a chapstick aficionado. I'm not joking. She has more chapstick than I, than I just, it's, it's an unhealthy obsession and we should be concerned. She put this in her top three. I mean, that's a big deal. She, I mean, she put this in her top three lip balms. I mean, <laughs> so I was like, okay, I'll go pick one up and try it out. So in case you're wondering what her other two in her top three were, um, it's the Lip Smackers uh, uh, Dr. Pepper, which if you haven't tried that, where have you been? Because that's kind of like a cult classic sort of thing. Um, that was in her top three, and then she said, Oh shoot, what was the third one? The th it was a wine one. It was wine... Uh, what's that girly wine? Uh, what is that girly wine? It's the one that all women like and it's like fruity-ish and I can't remember the name of it because I don't really drink it that often. Anyway! It's a wine-based chapstick and she loves that one too, so in case you were wondering. That wasn't helpful. I'll, I'll remember it and I'll put it in the, the right here. Okay. Alright, the last thing that I have to show you is this pair of false lashes, and this is um, from Makeup Academy, which is now showing up at CVS. I don't know if it's available anywhere, anywhere else, but these are their natural feathered lashes, I guess. And these are very, very similar 
looking at them anyway to the Ardell 110s, which are my favorite like everyday sort of looking lashes, not that I actually wear them every day, but um, they looked very similar and I wanted to try them. I believe these were only $5. They look a lot nicer packaging wise and style wise than the Ardell ones, so I was like, well, we'll see. But I think they were on sale. I can't remember. It was a long time ago. Okay. Eh. Alright, so thank you guys for watching and I guess the next time you see me will be post Vegas. Hopefully I'll be a little bit tanner. Um, okay, that's it. I'll see you guys later. Bye!